France seeks India's partnership for next-gen nuclear-powered aircraft carrier. France has formally proposed a landmark partnership with India to co-develop a next-generation nuclear-powered aircraft carrier, signaling a major leap in Indo-French defense collaboration. The project, targeting a displacement of 75,000 to 78,000 tons and delivery by the late 2030s, aims to bolster India's naval power in the Indo-Pacific while advancing France's technological ambitions. Carrier Specifications and Capabilities The proposed carrier will measure 305 meters in length with a 17,000-square-meter flight deck capable of hosting 30-plus advanced aircraft, including Rafale jets, next-gen fighters NGF, E-2D Hawkeye surveillance planes, and helicopters. It will integrate cutting-edge systems like the Electromagnetic Aircraft Launch System, EMALS, and Advanced Arrestor Gear, AOG, mirroring the U.S. Navy's Ford-class carriers to enhance operational efficiency. France envisions using this design for India's Indigenous Aircraft Carrier 3, IAC-3, a larger successor to the INS Vikrant class, strategic collaboration and technology sharing. While France will supply non-nuclear systems, e.g., EMALS, deck design, India will develop its own 190-megawatt nuclear reactor for propulsion, leveraging expertise from its submarine and SSBN programs. This aligns with India's Make in India goals, fostering self-reliance in defense tech. The partnership builds on decades of Indo-French military cooperation, including joint exercises like Varuna and defense deals like the Rafale jets and Scorpen submarine. The project faces hurdles, notably the high cost of integrating emails, which could strain India's defense budget. Additionally, India's nascent nuclear propulsion technology requires rigorous testing. However, the collaboration offers long-term strategic dividends, enhancing India's blue water capabilities to counterbalance China's growing influence in the Indo-Pacific. Broader implications. This initiative underscores France's commitment to the Indo-Pacific, complementing its recent naval deployments such as the Charles de Gaulle CSG's joint exercises with India under Mission Clemenceau 25. For India, the carrier represents a critical step toward its goal of a nuclear-powered 65,000-ton vessel, enabling sustained power projection and regional security leadership. Conclusion The Indo-French carrier project symbolizes a fusion of technological ambition and strategic trust. By merging France's naval engineering prowess with India's industrial resolve, this partnership could redefine maritime power dynamics, ensuring a free and secure Indo-Pacific. As both nations navigate technical and financial challenges, their collaboration sets a precedent for global defense innovation.